Hi, I'm David. And I'm Rachel. Welcome to Leisure Bit. And today we're coming to you from Sykeside and Brothers Water in the Lake District. Let's go and take a look around. Leisure Bit is the way to go with David, Rachel and Roxy. Let's hit the road and explore. We pick up our journey in Patterdale as we head towards Sykeside Campsite and Brothers Water. Continuing down the road, we then pass Brothers Water. We head down this track. Worth noting, if you have a large motorhome, you might find it very tight through there and you're probably best going in through the pub car park. I'd certainly recommend going out through the pub car park. So here we are at Sykeside campsite, which is just near to Brothers Water, up Patterdale in the Lake District. Let's go and take a look around. The pitch has a 16 amp electrical hookup. We paid just over £70 for the pitch and that was for two nights for two adults and a dog. The pitch is also hard standing, so handy if the weather's a little bit off and the grass is still a little bit soft so they did ask us to keep off the grass, which makes a lot of sense. Just taking a wander up to the pub now. Apparently Rachel and Roxy have made the way there. So we'll go and check it out. It's the Brothers Water Inn. Various places for rubbish and recycling. It's a cute little bridge there. We've got the reception where we checked in on the way in. As well as the reception, there's also a very well stocked shop that has lots of things that would come in handy for your break. And it was open until eight o'clock when we were there. We've got the main facilities block. You have your own cold disposal point. We've got drinking water, ladies' toilets. The toilets and showers were clean and tidy. Gents' toilets and the laundry. Let's go and take a look. In the laundry there were a couple of sinks, tumble dryers, as well as washing machines. Some more drinking water. There used to be um, part of the pub at this end, which is the barn end bar, however that's currently closed. Just up the hill from reception is a lovely dog walking area. It's really nice. And we'll head round to the Brothers Water Inn. The Brothers Water Inn has seating both outside and inside. If you're coming and staying at the site, it's worth booking well in advance to get a table in the Brothers Water Inn, as it can get very busy, especially on weekends and bank holidays. We didn't contact them early enough for a table, so we didn't manage to get booked in for a meal, unfortunately. But we did pop in for a drink, which was really nice. And there were some interesting things around the pub. Great selection of drinks as well. That was a nice little stop off there for a swift half in the pub. Now we're heading to the lake, Brothers Water, which the, uh, which the pub takes its name from. I've got something better for you. I met an old man I said, tell me your story He took out an old pen And wrote something for me Seen a ghost. Then I down at what he 
we're making our way down to Brothers Water, just over there. Said, son, when you grow up, you'll be fine. I know you've got questions on your mind. Life is gonna happen one way or the other, whether you like it or not. Stop looking for the answers, and you'll find. Brothers Water used to be known as broad water, but in the 19th century two brothers drowned in it and its name was then changed to Brothers Water. I'm a young man. It's about a five, ten minute walk down to the edge of Brothers Water. Searching for glory. Sunday morning we had a lovely evening yesterday had a good sleep we're up and about early this morning it's strange when you're on a site that mainly is tents rather than motorhomes and caravans because everybody is up a lot earlier so there's a lot of activity first thing this morning it's a beautiful day I think it's going to be red hot again today Unfortunately, it's the day we need to head back home. Originally, we were booked in to stay until Monday as we were meeting a friend of mine from the US. And uh, we were going to do a little bit of a tour around. They'd hired a camper van, but unfortunately, he fell off a ladder and uh, broke his, his leg and his wrist. So he's unable to drive. Originally, we were due to meet here at Sykeside, but it was nice to come along anyway. I'd have loved to stay a bit longer and definitely come back at some point because some of these hills are begging to be climbed. It's lovely to see all the lambs at this time of year, isn't it? This is my kind of place. Absolutely love the Lake District, love the countryside. Absolutely brilliant. When we wake birds and see the sun side by side our fears are done all the good times just begun oh we know what we have let's hold on tight so rachel what have you thought of Sykeside and brothers water what a peaceful an idyllic location. It's been a beautiful campsite. The sun has had his hat on and Roxy's been in the lake. What more is there to like? It's been really good. What have you thought? I think it's an absolute cracking site for coming if you're going for a walk. Plenty of hills and mountains around here. I think last time I was here was about ooh, 18 years ago and I went for a walk 
uh, along Brothers Water, um, down to Patterdale, and then up Helvellyn. And then on the way back, it was a tough climb, that one, if you've ever done it. Uh, let us know in the comments. Uh, yeah, quite a difficult one. And uh, anyway, on the way back, I spotted the bus at Patterdale, so I took the last few miles from here uh, to Patterdale on the bus uh, to get back. And when I got back, we had the motorhome at the time. Uh, nearly fell into it. I um, seem to remember that you didn't move for days after that <laughs> because you were that achy. Yeah, but absolutely cracking area for walking. Nice site, uh, handy pub. Do make sure you book though um, if you're wanting food in there. If you want a drink, it's not such an issue. And a lovely well-stocked shop. So yeah, really nice site and we definitely recommend it. And lovely rural Lake District location. Thank you for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. And we will catch you for the next bit. Bye. Bye.